Damn, little balcony vibes. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah, I know what the balcony vibes is. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Everything black. You feel me? What it do? What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Black, and I'm back again with another video. Today, the second day that we in Miami. Let me turn this music off. I get copyright like a motherfucker. I just checked into the Airbnb. And I need a haircut bad. I'm out here in Miami, y'all, with no cut. Shit, crazy, man. Just trash. Shit, crazy, man. No cut at all. Just fuck it. Dude, trash. Huh. Hmm. That's strange. That's a special. I'm just waiting on my Uber. And no drivers nearby? It's taking a minute. All right, so I'll start you at the front door. Got the door. You turn in. It's like the kitchen, y'all. And for some reason, they go to the fridge and shit. I don't even think I'm gonna use any of this shit for, for a little stove top. It's not even hard, though. But the thing about this motherfucker is, is that right now it's Memorial Day weekend. So shit, how in the motherfucker? Like prices, I think the cheapest Airbnb I seen that was like a decent looking Airbnb was like, 800, 900 a night. And that was some, it still was some bullshit. But here go the bedroom. You know what I'm saying? So had me a little vibe slide through there. Yee! And then we got the little balcony. Got the balcony. Little chill, little vibe, little smoke vibe. Little drop vibe, drink, listen to music. We got, I'm in Brickle right now. My dumb ass didn't even realize I was recording that shit in slow mo just now. But oh, it's Memorial Day weekend, so this shit packed. Like, y'all see the traffic down there. That shit ridiculous. I know it's gonna be a minute for the Ubers and then the boats. I think we got a boat, I think tomorrow. Or it's today, I forgot. It's Memorial Day weekend, so right now, all of the, the fucking Airbnbs and Hotels. I think the cheapest hotel that was like a, a good hotel where I would stay at was like 600, 700, five, six, 700. And I was cool. So I ended up just getting an Airbnb down here in Brickle, which is still hot as fuck because of the weekend. But, but I stayed at my boy Fresh Pin CEO house. You know what I'm saying? Follow him down below. Uh, shout out to him. But he let me crash, let us crash there, me and Marco. Uh, but he let me crash there for the night. And then I booked this yesterday so that I could get it today. And thank God I got it because I know there ain't no, it wasn't nothing like this for like the price range where it was like even, even near acceptable to pay, you know what I'm saying? So thank God I got this one, but yeah, it's a little vibe. Let me get y'all a tour. You know what I'm saying? A little balcony vibes, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> I know what the balcony vibes, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> she already got this one for the junkie. It's still looking for a damn Uber driver. I probably have to call a lift. Yeah, I probably have to call a lift. What did I say? I ain't going far, but I know how this shit go. 
All right, so hopefully we'll see which one book first. I know I'm not the only one to be doing this. That'd be like, if y'all can't get one on Uber fast enough, y'all go to um, Lyft. So, I mean, we're gonna see, we're gonna check back in. I brought a little, some little drip down here. Put Cactus Jack long sleeve with these. And I might, I might fuck them up with the, I'll just keep the coach. So I don't need the coach, but then bust this down today. I'm gonna put this on, show y'all. Then y'all know I keep the I keep some shit in the bag. Sheesh. I don't know, should I wear these though? Mm. Drop down in the comments what y'all think I should do. The cold whites with the little essential little fit. Or the uh or the easy comfortable. The easy comfortables. Just some comfortables, y'all. And then what else I got? I think that's bullshit in here for real, for real. All right, but I'm gonna get ready right now to go to um, uh, my boy Fresh Prince CEO. He got a podcast. Oh shit, it's two minutes away. He got a podcast called uh, called Fresh and Fit. Go check it out right now on YouTube, y'all. But uh, my brother Marco, he gonna be on the podcast, and I might do a, a special uh, special from. Uh, Drop in, pop in, pop in and shit uh, on the episode. So y'all stay tuned for that. But if you're new here, like, comment, subscribe. It's your boy Black. And I'm just taking out part of my lifestyle because I got to document this shit because niggas know what the fuck about to happen when I do what I try to do when niggas got big, big. That's why. That's why. Twitter, make sure to hit Twitter and uh, Facebook later on in the middle of the show. Yeah. I mean, like 10 to yeah. 5 minutes in or so. Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome to Fresh Air Podcast. Myron Gaines, Fresh Air CEO. We're here with Funny Marco, man. It's gonna be lit. Let's get into Let's it, get guys. It, man. So, that's exactly why you're born. This podcast right now is going crazy. I'm gonna insert some clips for the podcast. You get canceled for telling for saying what you want in women. You get canceled for that shit. Yeah. What, what's I mean, uh, just like he said, I just never. If we look at videos to the day, it's like women, all in videos. I've never seen a girl video with a bunch of dudes dancing in shape, fit. It's just like women rule the world. Like like he said, it's like we go on a little baby video, a money bag yo video. It's women, 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 women. But girls, I have not seen a mega stash video where it's a bunch of niggas just in there showing their body. Like yeah, I'm creating fat niggas that. But we can do that. So it's just like kind of like when you say that you get like women, y'all rule the world. And if a man say something. When it comes to that, like y'all or the real, that's just what it is. So they saying, they say facts. Yeah, women yeah. run the fashion industry, women run journalism. Like I told you, the reason why what we're saying is so shocking and rude and crazy is because men don't say these things. Yeah, You know what I'm saying? That's why it's so nuts to you guys and you're saying, I don't like the delivery, whatever. Because when men speak, we say stuff like this that hurts feelings. It's the women that are putting the pressure on you guys like that. Like I told you before. All right, so what it do? What's good, YouTube? So I got these fucking tickets to this movie. The fucking seat's supposed to move. The shit's supposed to, air supposed to blow in your face, thunder, lightning, you're supposed to feel everything. Yeah. And this is what the fuck we coming into. It's cold as fuck in here. Oh my God, the fuck, fuck, fuck. All right. Say about this boy, he's scared. We do this. We do this, right? What do you do? We do this. What do you do? We do this. What is this? You see what I'm, you see my clip right I don't see nothing. <laughs> she was shaking her ass. You was in your phone, Leo. No, I wasn't. I mean, what are you doing? What are you doing? Hey, Pat, take an email. Who? Hey, it's my phone. What's going on? No, no, no. It's okay. No. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. He definitely. We're ready, man. Stop, bro. Look at him. Look at 
need some glasses. They like, I need, we need these glasses. Yeah. 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 Yeah.